It's the fourth week of the month, which means we get to wrap up the last of the changes coming with the latest Google System Services updates. There are only two small things to make note of here, so this will be a quick one. First up, we have the update for the Google Play Services application that brings it up to version 25.33. With it, Google has added some new developer features for themselves and third-party devs, which help support Maps-related processes within their applications. But it's this feature that has piqued my interest. After updating to this version, Anyone using Android on a smartphone should now be able to manage their storage across the device all in one place. And we only have a single change log for the Google Play Store update that brings it up to version 47.7. .7. But once you have this version installed, you'll now begin to see a warning message within the details page for watch faces that have been detected to be draining your battery excessively. A small but undoubtedly important new addition that will make those who use Wear OS much happier, since it will help them to learn what is causing their smartwatch battery to drain so quickly. Last up, we have this small update to the Android web view that brings it up to version 140. And the big change here is some improvements to security and privacy in updates that actually fix a number of bugs. But we also have this note talking about improving the developer features for Google and third-party devs that support functionality related to displaying web content to their apps. So similar to the supporting maps related processes, this is for displaying web content since it's the Android web view. And that's it. Like I said, there isn't much in this change log for this week, but the two or big changes that I pointed out do seem like really nice additions for us to have. As always, you can update these individually through the apps section of your settings, but I also did a video this week showing you the one new hidden place that you can go to update Google system apps. So I'll be sure to link to that down below, and I would appreciate it if you all would watch that as well. Just don't forget to click on that like button because it helps to keep me motivated here, and subscribe to the channel too if you haven't done so already.